What's the best sex you've ever had? Best sex I've ever had? Yeah. I should probably say with my boyfriend, right? <laughs> What's the best sex you've ever had? The best sex I've ever had. Uh, <laughs> Ooh. That's a real loaded question. That's really hard. It's hard to pinpoint it. What's the best sex you've ever had? What do you mean, what's it? What is it? What's is there a specific it? moment? In detail? Do you want viv, like, do you want me to? Mm -hmm. uh. <laughs> Obviously, it's my fiance. My current partner. Current partner. Current girlfriend, right now? That's a good answer. My husband and I, we were all staying in a hotel room. Presidential suite. We're gonna have sex everywhere. Like, <laughs> this is what you do in a suite. We had an office, we ended up having sex on his desk. We didn't know there was a window cleaner. <laughs> I guess he was mesmerized. And countertop sex, car sex. The hood of my car. In the stairwell. On the beach. He's so loud you can hear it echo across the water. Sex in a house, on the bed, that's me. People in the car, outside of the car, in the rain, in a park, on a beach. I'm like, you people are bananas, sand's gonna get in your vagina. What's the best sex you've ever had? I would say when I broke my bed. We literally broke the bed. You give a man some Hennessy and uh, things just get a little, little crazy. Do not have crazy, amazing sex on a bed from Ikea. <laughs> What's the best sex you've ever had? Oh God, I don't want my mom to see this. See, I'm like, ugh, what? <laughs> <laughs> I don't usually talk about stuff like this, so. I'm not answering this. <laughs> Without saying who or? No, I just, <laughs> not, <laughs> it's just no, not me. The best sex I ever had was probably when I was like 19 and I was getting fucked and I, I was able to come without jacking off. I thought that was a pretty big deal. What's the best sex you've ever had? Uh, I think the most memorable time would probably be the first time. First girlfriend. We had known each other for so long and never did anything about it. Finally it was happening. We both were, were pretty inexperienced at the time. I didn't really know what I was doing and neither did he and so it kind of felt like vulnerable and loving. I mean it probably wasn't like the best for her. I haven't had good sex. I mean the guy was super kind and, and cool but it, it wasn't good. <laughs> I can't say I've had Amazing sex. I've had no good sex. Nothing stands out. I'm a virgin, so no sex. <laughs> What's the best sex you've ever had? Toxic sex. Like, you know you shouldn't be fucking, but you still do, and that's like the thrill. This guy that I can't stand now. It was great, but he's a piece of shit. Me and my girlfriend like just broke up, and the last time we had sex was at the bomb. Damn. Shout out to her, though. That was the only level we connected, and so it just went away as quickly as it came. And ain't seen her since. <sighs> John, if you're out there, I'm still kind of wondering why you ghosted me, but it's okay if you don't want to say. You can still get it. What's the best sex you've ever had? With my long distance partner. I hadn't seen him in so long. There was a lot of build to that night. I just remember that we had seen each other at the door, and we both knew about to tear each other apart. I'm having some good sex with my a neighbor of mine right now. This morning even actually. <laughs> neighbor uh, came over and- You have sex with your neighbor a lot? Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, probably just a few days ago with my boyfriend. <laughs> Trying new things out. I thought that guy was like really vanilla and then he just took me by surprise. It was just like stuff that she did. I was like, whoa, where did you learn that? There's, you know, a lot of waterworks. One time I got fingered while I was driving. I cross-dressed and sucked on a strap-on that she had on. I've always been like ashamed and like afraid of like sharing that with partners and she was like, that's so fucking hot. What's the best sex you've ever had? Well, it was a threesome. <laughs> I just put a little unicorn emoji in my in my profile and I ended up matching with a couple and they were like so sweet. Then I ended up storming out on them out of anger at one point and then I came back and ended up having sex with them. It was one of the most exciting experiences I've had. The best sex you've ever had. I think I was drunk. Hi. At a music festival. Ate like edibles, acid, mushrooms. It was just like like. Boop, 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 boop. Your energy's more wavy, I guess. You can like sort of feel the other person's pleasure. We had an emotionally charged evening. My heart was just like bursting with like happiness and like love. I was like, like I really love you. Tell each other that we love each other and like look into each other's eyes. I've never felt such a connection with another person in my entire life. There's a lot of chemistry. We laughed about it, it was fun. It was the first time that sex was like really fun. I got sexually assaulted, so like I'm not super comfortable with like sexual encounters. And so I was with somebody that I really trusted. 
I didn't hate it. We're pretty comfortable with each other. It was kind of like more like building intimacy. It was like after my I had my top surgery, for the first time, I felt like that person was into me as the person that I think that I am. He was a very passionate and emotional man, and he had a big schlong, so. What makes for good sex for me is probably I'd have to say size. Big dick always helps. She had a fat ass. He was very generous. Like, very giving. Not afraid to like eat the vagina, eat the butt. She was just like in that shit like a buffet. They were just like such a good communicator. What makes for good sex? Both parties are uh, putting in to what's going on. Having fun is the goal. Not orgasm. Whips and chains are all good. We usually go to like a sex store. I use toys. Do you think more couples should use toys? Yeah, yeah, I do. Like male and female toys. This gets the job done. Would that help improve sex for you? <gasps> oh my gosh, it's vibrating! Oh, this one's way better than mine. Well, lucky for you, Adam and Eve is offering 50% off with promo code CUT, C-U-T. Sweet. I've actually buy them from Adam and Eve, so that's beneficial. There's 50% off this little bastard. <laughs> I'm so excited. I don't know how to turn it off, however. <laughs> I'll be just walking around the house. <laughs> Woo!